savory, insanely delicious, flavorful Creole grilled red snapper with some Creole sauce. Trust me, it's the best. Keep watching ahead. hello hello everybody how is it going i trust or i hope everyone is doing great today we are going to be making this oven grilled red snapper that's the creole style with some creole sauce when i made this recipe trust me it was so so good if you're new here a very big welcome to you please do not go away without hitting the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so right here we have the red snapper scaled gutted washed with some lemon and for the rest of the ingredients we have some ginger powder onion powder black pepper cayenne powder and some parsley also we have some creole seasoning and some fish seasoning if you have any other fish seasoning or any seasoning of your choice then you can go ahead and use it or any preferred way of seasoning or marinating your red snapper you can use it but if you want to marinate or season please use the creole seasoning also for the creole seasoning you can definitely do homemade if you want to so right here i'm just going to add some oil inside mix everything then we're going to get on to prep our fish so to prep the fish i'm going to take out all the fins then score the fish and begin marinating So after rubbing in the ingredients perfectly, I'm going to transfer onto my grilling tray, then broil 400 degrees Fahrenheit, 8 to 10 minutes each side. While you're grilling, keep adding the marinade on it. While for the fresh ingredients here, we have some green onion, some celery, thyme, bell peppers, onion, tomatoes and some fresh parsley right, for the other ingredients we have some minced garlic chili sauce Worcestershire sauce in there some butter you can use any hot sauce if you want to I will chop or slice all the fresh ingredients with this chopper
so the first part of the fish has been broiled i will just throw some of this marinade there then flip sides rub the marinade again and send it back in the oven let it finish grilling in a hot pan or skillet add some cooking oil then melt in some butter Please check the description box because I'm going to be dropping the detailed recipe. At this point, bring all the ingredients and saute for about 5 minutes. At this point, I'm going to be using some chicken broth. The chicken broth already has salt and a little taste of some bouillon cubes. I'm going to be showing you how I made my chicken stock with this chicken nose seasoning. Just take the powder broth mix and mix inside warm water and you have your chicken broth. That's definitely what I used. So I'm, I just added some water. I'm just letting simmer again for about two minutes and the sauce will be ready to serve let's see if our fish has been fully cooked you see it just pulls away from the bone cooked to perfection so flavorful the creole sauce is so so good i love eating this with rice like my favorite rice is here i'm just going to taste everything and see how it feels or tastes in the mouth So guys, we've come to the end of the recipe for today. And if you like or love this video, please don't forget to give a thumbs up, comment, and share. Till we meet again in my next video, bye for now and keep trusting my recipes.